Hello! Here's Corsi fam. So in today's video we're gonna be talking about that high chair behind me. The reason because Annabelle is not using it anymore, so we figured we're just gonna clean it up and tell you what we liked and what we didn't like about it. <laughs> Happy summer! I'm presenting to you a skeleton of a high chair. Like the shimmy shake? Shimmy, shimmy. What are you doing? Exactly the way it was out of the box. <laughs> Prima papa. Prima papa. Zero three. Hello. Hey guys! Welcome to Conflicting Times. We did the deep clean of this thing and put it back together. Misplaced one of these straps, so I promise, in the box it comes with the proper amount of straps. What's the story of this? So what are we doing today? We're gonna give you our opinions of the Prima Papa 03 high chair. We know why you're watching this video. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay? <laughs> is the okay. apocalypse coming? No! Before we get into it, does this high chair worth three hundred dollars, Alyssa? Depends. It depends on who's going to be using it. We should note that we got this as a gift when you're a parent to be and you're prepping for the the world of a tiny potato. You're a little overwhelmed, and when it comes to high chairs, that is so far off away from your mind. If you know you're someone who lives their home in the kitchen, wants something that's gonna last from newborn stage all the way up to toddlerhood, this may be the chair for you. Why do you call this brand? Peg Perego. Peg Perego itself has some pretty good videos about this specific high chair. We're not gonna go through all the features that it does and it has. We're gonna go through the features that we personally used and we appreciated using. First point and probably the best point. It's not just a high chair, it's also another location to put your immobile child. For example, Chuba, whenever he had to use the bathroom and it was his morning, we could put Annabelle in this chair because of the way that it leaned back and she could come to the washroom with us. Woo! Woo! Look how comfy cozy this is! And it's on four wheels. Sometimes your chair just gets pushed around into random places. So one really nice thing about this chair is that it has two locks, one for the front wheels and one for the back. I will say all the buttons are very intuitive. This had very distinct, do you wanna put this down? Here you go. It all kind of makes sense. We were able to use it from newborn stage. Right? And that fact alone meant Annabelle could have suppers and dinners with us immediately. We could put her in the chair, wheel her up to the table. She is asleep, she's awake, who cares? She's part of dinner. Second, I really like this material that this thing is made out of. It's a polyester, eco-friendly leather. Fake leather, this is very easy to wipe it clean. It's quite high and padded, so mm. I didn't mind Annabelle sitting multiple hours in here because I knew she was gonna be comfortable. Where at the cottage, we had a more flimsy high chair. She did not wanna be in it for more than 20 minutes or 30 minutes at a time. There are buttons here that you could just take off the bottom, clean that off, dust it off, and then pop it back on. Things happen here. The next very good feature, the tray. I don't know, it just feels sturdy. It feels easy. You just kind of like pop it right in. Boom. And it even has this plastic, see-through plastic at the top. That's a dishwasher safe. Did we ever put this in a dishwasher? I have. Yeah. There is like this very easy, simple way of just like... You know? But bam! <laughs> Another big thing about this chair too is that you can adjust the height. So depending on how big or wide your table is, the whole thing goes up and down. It's very easy to travel with as well. That's another good feature. You have these buttons to the side. When it's folded, it just kind of stands on its own. Just because of COVID, <laughs> we kept our traveling to a minimal. It holds a certain regard of memories for us. That's where Annabelle had her first food, a goulash for the first time with your family. Annabelle doesn't like sitting in high chairs or booster chairs for that matter. So how long did we use this? A year and a yeah, half. A year and a half. A little bit more. Depending on your kid, you might be using it a whole lot longer. Super light but strong. So many times when Annabelle was actually standing up and jumping in this chair. I never had any concern about her breaking just because of how well built it is. Yeah. So that, that was kind of nice. I really miss those days because now I'm freaking out every time. Now we are ready to put this chair away until we might need it for the second one, I guess. Answering the ultimate question, Alyssa. Is this high chair worth $300? Yes. And if you're willing to pay for a $300 chair because you know you're gonna use it and you want the longevity of it. What did your uncle say? They told us that the number one thing that they used when they, with their kids was a high chair. That's from my aunt and uncle. Thank you so much, Joe and Laura. Okay, that was it. I liked it. I'm <laughs> sad it's going away, but I'm also glad to have the floor space back. And I'm also getting really upset that Annabelle keeps stealing my chair at the supper table and then giggling about it. If you thought this video was helpful, give it a big old thumbs up if you want to <laughs> 
tune in for some more, you hit that subscribe button. And if you want to know when we put out things to the world, oh, you press the bell button. A lot of more tricks and tricks coming. We have so many wisdom to share with you. Oh, look at us. Wise old owl parents. <laughs> woo, woo, woo. Remember when we bought this house and we were like, we're going to be millennial DIYers. And here we are with a high chair uh, with some lights and some cats. Anyway, the high chair is nice. There is an Amazon link down in the description if you want to check it out. Follow us on Instagram. We have an Instagram page now. A lot of behind the scenes. We should have a tagline, something like that. Love you like a sister. Ta-ta for now. Okay, I'm Gotta gonna... go! <laughs>